What is an inverter system? We've done videos on these inverter systems and different verbiages. We're gonna talk about some of those, but if you are in the market for a heating and air system and you keep hearing this, what's an inverter? They keep talking about inverter systems. We're gonna talk about what exactly they are, why you should care as a homeowner, and why it really is going to matter as time goes on. So first, my name is Josh. I host the HVAC Guide for Homeowners YouTube channel. Let's dive right into this. What is an inverter system? What? We hear all kinds of folks saying inverter, VRF, VRV, variable speed compressors, all these different verbiages, and they all ultimately, I know there's different technologies out there with communicating and non-communicating, but ultimately if somebody says they have an inverter system, is a system that has a compressor that can ramp up and down. Now again, some use different technologies to make that happen, but ultimately you've got a compressor instead of a single stage system that runs full speed or off or a multi-stage system where there might be in-betweens, an inverter system is going to be able to ramp up and down based on the load, based on the technology that's in it. Some systems are simpler than others where they just monitor the evaporator coil temperature. Some of them are a little more advanced and they can actually measure what's the outdoor temperature. Hey, it's kind of a mild day. Let's just barely run today and save this customer energy. What folks are finding is when they're comparing systems and they're looking at things like SEER ratings and EER and HSPF and all these different ratings, they're not always a good accurate representation of how efficient one system is going to be to another. Meaning you might have a system that has just as high of a SEER rating, but if it's a non-inverter system, it's not actually going to be as efficient as some of these inverter systems. Inverter systems have the capability of at times just barely be running. It's almost like a dimmer switch that you see on some lights where that dimmer switch can bring that light way down, that light's just barely drawing any electricity, and in the grand scheme of things, saving the homeowner tons of money. Now let me throw a couple things at you that you may not know. The first thing is a lot of terms like variable speed, things like that are being thrown around. In some cases it confuses folks. A lot of contractors will say variable speed system. What they're really alluding to is the indoor fan motor is variable speed. It does not necessarily mean you have an inverter, VRF, VRV type outdoor unit or even a compressor that has the variable capabilities or inverter capabilities. We've seen variable speed air handlers or furnaces be matched with a single speed outdoor unit. Now does it make it a little more energy efficient? Yeah, a little bit, but it's not the same thing. Just be aware of that. If somebody throws around terms like variable speed, they may not necessarily mean an inverter system, especially a communicating inverter system. Next, let me also point out that a lot of contractors, even some that might comment on this video, are very wary of using them. They'll even fight you in some cases, tell you that it doesn't make sense in their particular area for one reason or another. They are putting up a fight. Some contractors just simply won't install them yet. And the reason I say yet is because inverter systems are the future. Roads, where we're going, we don't need roads. I believe over the next decade, you're going to see the U.S. market especially, but the North American market really take hold with inverter systems like never before. We're the Wild West, if you will, when it comes to this technology. Don't any of you have the guts to play for blood? I'm your huckleberry. Because if you go outside of our continent, other parts of the world, they only have inverter systems because they're so efficient. In America, we like our gas guzzling cars and we like our ducted single speed air conditioning systems. Other parts of the world are way ahead of us on this. So I believe in the very near future, you're going to see not just more inverter systems being sold, you're going to be seeing some contractors only offer inverter technology. You're gonna see some homeowners that only want inverter systems installed and these contractors that have not come along, that they have put up this fight and tried not to install this technology, that they may get left behind. Do I think they're gonna get left behind? No, they'll just eventually have to get with the program, right? I will say, as you navigate through this, that one thing we are also seeing is this whole market of folks that do single speed and multi-stage systems, but then you've got this whole nother side of folks that know that inverters are the future, but they're all trying to pretend that they're all the same and they're just not. We at Griffin Air, we sell Daikin, for example, and Daikin is the best, in my opinion, 
at Inverter Technology. They're leading the way. In fact, they created the technology decades ago, back when I was a small boy over in Japan. I wasn't a small boy in Japan. I was a small boy here in America, but they created the first VRV system over in Japan. What? And even now, they've got the Daikin Fit, they've got the VRV Life, and they've just got all these different systems that have technology that no one else has. And that's part of the reason we sell them. We mostly sell them because of how reliable they are. But even if you don't go Daikin and you go with another brand, just realize they're not all created equal. Do your homework, find a good contractor that has installed them. You don't wanna be anybody's guinea pig. And now with all of these government rebates and incentives to install these higher SEER systems, these inverter type systems, you're gonna see a massive shift in this market to more contractors offering them and again, more homeowners looking to purchase them. I had somebody comment and say, Josh, you keep talking about inverters. I don't even know what they are. That's what they are in a nutshell, a system that can ramp up and down and save you money. So I hope that helps. Thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe button. We'll see you next time.